This video will highlight the Tecla TED's masonry column design calculation to the Euro codes. Before running any calculation within the library, always read the associated notes which cover the scope, important assumptions and limitations and references. Examples for vertical loading with or without eccentricity, and vertical and wind loading are provided within the library. These can also be used as a starting point for your own designs. The input parameters include the column details you wish to consider, the combination and loading, design options, masonry unit details, material factors and output options. Calculation preview results and a live sketch update to reflect your input. Design options sets the national annex upon which the design is based and whether the normalized mean strength is to be specified or calculated in accordance with Annex A of BSCN 772 Part 1. You specify the width, thickness and clear height of the column. The Combinations button allows you to specify the combination type you wish to consider and the combination factor for variable action. Additional information is available where you see an information symbol. The loading button allows you to specify the vertical load, eccentricity and any wind load to be considered. The masonry unit and mortar details are specified. Depending upon the method chosen in design options, the normalized mean compressive strength is either specified or calculated based upon further input using the Calculate button. This automatically opens the TED's normalized compressive strength of masonry calculation to BSEN 772 Part 1 calculation. This can also be found directly in the TED's library. The Material Factors button allows the partial safety factors for material strength to be specified. The calculation preview results for the selected combination are displayed. The maximum value is compared against the capacity and the utilization ratio and a pass or fail status is reported. If anything fails, the failures can be reviewed and amendments made to the input. Once you are satisfied with the input and preview results, you can specify the output options including the level of detail and the inclusion of a summary table. You can also provide a note and amend the title. Confirm the information and your design and the calculation output is written to the document. The calculation input geometry, masonry column details, loading details and the design calculation checks are all laid out in a clear and concise format. 